bless up bless up my viewers welcome back to the channel watch like share comment and subscribe hit the bell if you are also new to the channel so do remember you know the more you like the video the more youtube recommend it among its algorithm yeah man so you know the more you like your video the more you push the subscription button yeah man the more you show interest in a video you know and the more youtube recommend it to other people out there just as yourself my viewers so just continue to do the right thing to watch like share comment and subscribe man killed in clarendon a 22 year old man was gone down in sangonet clarendon on tuesday night he has been identified as kurt douglas of a white shop district address in the parish it is report that about 11.45 p.m. Douglas was walking along the Cohen Street with a friend when they were attacked by gunmen who shot him several times. The police were called to the scene. Douglas was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced. His friend escaped on earth, the police say. Douglas is one of two people to be killed in the parish on Tuesday. Fruit vendor Keith Maclash was gone down in Maypen, the parish capital, about 8.30 p.m. A state of public emergency was declared in Clarendon today. 20 million allocated for upgrading of Clarendon Parish Court. The government to spend 20 million on renovation and upgrading works at the Clarendon Parish Court. The information is contained in the 2023-24 estimate of expenditure which was tabled in the House of Representatives on Tuesday by Minister of Finance Dr. Nigel Clark. The, rehab the, rehabilitation, the rehabilitation will address the infrastructural inadequacies of the exist building to satisfy the mandates and fulfill organizational strategic objective as of december 2022 courtroom furniture has been refurbished elevator install and commission electronic system system security system implement and plumbing fixtures come on my viewers right the same right and then you know you know, no, say people and make sure say yo the courtroom all right for dash or someone no boy behind bars so that is it so viewers continue to like share comment and subscribe you know my viewers so right now we have a little case i want to start out so corruption prosecutor to probe oldness conflict of interest allegation the integrity commission has referred a report implicating Prime Minister Andrew Onis in an alleged conflict of interest to the direct of corruption prosecution after its conclude that he may have influenced the awarding of millions of dollars in government contracts to company of business associated. The recommendation was made in a 107-page report which contains detail of an investigative